Also new this morning, the flu is spreading across the nation, including high flu activity reports here in Alabama. And potentially even in this studio. So in this right. week's Living Well with Michelle, we are definitely focused on prevention, right, Michelle? Yeah, we're trying to stay healthy, but right now the flu is so widespread, some schools in the Hayden area had to close their doors and disinfect the buildings earlier this month. So I met up with the doctor from Brookwood Baptist Medical Center. He walked me through the steps you can take to help yourself and keep the people around you from catching the flu. Getting the flu, we all know it's not fun stuff. It's like the community is overwhelmed with flu patients right now. Dr. Bruce Burns from Brookwood Baptist Medical Center says if you're sick and take off school or work, stay home. Many times people will take off work because they're sick and they go get their hair done. Well, guess what? They just infected the whole beauty shop. If you feel you might be sick and are in a public space, be careful when you cough or sneeze. The way you do it matters. We can always tell that how someone, their age by how they cough. You know, the older individual cough and put their hands over the mouth, where the younger individual puts their elbow over the mouth. The elbow's a better a way to cough because that way you're uh, taking the virus and keeping it into that elbow region. Whereas if I cough here, then I shake your hand, I didn't do you any good. He recommends scanning your work environment and cleaning commonly used items like phones. Plus, washing your hands properly and frequently is always a good idea. Just soap and water, okay, or a, a disinfectant. But that's not the number one thing that you can do. The number one thing you can do is get vaccinated. He says as long as you don't already have the flu, it's never too late to get the vaccine. Dr. Burns says if you get the flu vaccine, you can still get the flu, but it is highly unlikely that you will. And I know, Nate, you're not feeling too good, but so okay. we're, yeah. <laughs> All right. we're, we're not the calling flu. it the flu. Yeah. No. Yeah. no. <laughs> Calling We're it the crud. Yeah. And, yes. and he was saying that using, you know, those Clorox wipes, mm -hmm. yeah. it's a good idea. Those are you, those are helpful. And if you have a fever, stay home. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Be nice to everyone around you. Anybody, yeah. anybody, yeah. anybody want to hit? I got my own, uh, I I got my own over there. <laughs> I know. It's 551 right now. Of course, we've got much more news ahead. The stories that you need to know before you go are coming up next. Stay with us, guys. You're watching the CBS 42 Morning News. We've got local coverage you can call on. Mm -hmm. I promise. I promise. <laughs> <laughs>